Once I heard about the concept of the show, as far as materials went, I instantly wanted to take uh, the idea of electronics and how they are completely just, it's invisible space, to having something that's completely opposite. So wood, plexiglass, things that have a real 3D texture to them. That's instantly what I wanted to do. So our piece is called Through Rose Colored Filters. Uh, we have two pieces. One says hashtag no filter, the other says hashtag no such thing. Uh, I personally am the kind of person who's kind of extracted myself from the social media world in many ways. Um, I do find that a lot of what you see and a lot of what people present is very inauthentic and very curated. It's very interesting and I love it. I love exploring it and I love checking it all out, but um, we are so caught up in the fact of always looking our best on the internet. We're posting, you know, photos of our dinner uh, that is our best dinner we've ever made and uh, the next day we're eating craft dinner. And so I feel that what we're posting on the internet is essentially posted through a rose-colored filter at all times. We're always showing our best side off. Our piece is uh, plywood and we hand chose it so it has perfect or a really, really beautiful fluid uh, linear image to it. Um, then we hand cut each letter, which even just breaking down words into exact letters and hand cutting each letter like that even kind of strengthened our phrase even more for us. And then gave it a whole different weight to it. And then the third layer is plexiglass to add that physical filter, as you would add a filter to any sort of photo. So yeah, we wanted, to, we wanted it to be essentially a 3D object in the full sense of the word without being a complete sculpture. Uh, I think the 3D element by putting an actual filter in front of it does uh, speak to that and filters our message in itself just adding to that ironic level.